Well, hello, YouTube friends and family. Today, I'm going to be doing a what's in my denim Amazon tote bag. Um, this bag I got I, maybe a couple of weeks ago. I've been looking for a um, denim tote forever, but I couldn't find one that I liked until I ran across this one. Um, she has no feet. That's the name of her. She was only $27, guys. Um, her straps are a little wonky because she was packed in. Um, I left her in a box for a few days, so her totes, her straps are a little wonky, but it's okay. Uh, hopefully, they'll straighten out for me. I think they are because it was way worse than this. So, anyway, um, I'm not good at decorating totes like some of the other ladies here on YouTube. So I just have my initial C and a Bath and Body Work pocket back holder and a pocket back sanitizer. And I believe this uh, is in cherry, black cherry Merlot, is that how you say it? But it's in black cherry and it's got this cute little holder on it that has like sprinkles. So I don't do a lot of talking, so let's get inside the tote. She is stuffed, ladies. Um, so the first thing I'm gonna do is go to the back pocket. Um, this back pocket, I have this little um, leather coin pouch. I think it's a coin. Well, you know, it's like a wallet pouch, but I use it for coins and stuff like that. So I'm gonna open it up. So it has like a, I don't know if that's leather or suede, but that's what I use for coins right now. The next thing I have in here is some Kleenex tissues. And this is the little um, wallet looking one, the Slim pack. And I think that's it for the bottom back pocket. Um, in here, this is my coach zip around pouch. I don't know the exact name of it. I just buy stuff. So in here I have some keys and some vaccination cards. So that's what I keep in there. Um, here is my flushable wipes. As you can see, I labeled it. I labeled everything. This is my flushable wipes container or holder. I'm going to go ahead and get this stuff off the side. All right here is a little reusable natural groceries um, bag. Here in Colorado, they've stopped giving you like bags and stuff like that. So this one came from Natural Grocers here in Colorado and it's got elephants on it. So I absolutely love it. I am definitely, definitely an elephant fan. It's one of my favorite animals. Um, <clears throat> over here, this is my pocket puzzle word finds. Just to have something to do if you're out. Um, Back here, I have some antibacterial wipes. These ones came from Target. Right here, I have this little container. I got this idea from, an, from another YouTuber here on YouTube. Um, and it kind of keeps my Nutri-Grain bars from getting mushed. Because they are no fun trying to eat them when they're all mushy and soggy so i got two neutral grain bars in here and that's what i've been keeping them in this container came from shein so i like that um trying to get all the pouches out first before i get to the big ones this pouch here um has my here we go again with this container this uh pouch is hard to open it has some mask in it um, excuse my hands, they kind of dry from sanitizer and 
washing, but this container, or this, I keep saying container, guys, this pouch has some um, disposable mask in it. Um, like I said in the last video, we don't use mask here all the time. I live in Colorado. Um, certain places want you to mask up before you go in, like doctors and dentists, so, you know, I keep them in there. This is my little, um, portable, reusable, um, set of utensils. I also have a couple of dental floss picks in there. Sorry guys, you know the struggle of trying to do this one-handed. <laughs> okay, and this is my little pencil pouch that I got from the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna try to open it with one hand. And these are the pins I have in here right now. Gotta have a black Sharpie in there. Like, who doesn't need a black Sharpie at some point of another? So, some point or another. This right here is my little elephant that my oldest daughter gave me. I don't know if it was for my birthday or Christmas, but I kind of keep it in here for good luck. It's a beautiful elephant. I think it's like opal but it's gorgeous. Sometimes I carry it in my purse. Sometimes I don't because it's pretty heavy. So, you know, sometimes I carry it and sometimes I don't. But I do like it. I like it a lot. And she knows I love elephants, so she brought me that. I'm not sure if it was for birthday or just because or what, but I know that's one of the gifts I got. Um, hold on a second, guys. I kind of got a mess here. Hold on, you guys. Because what I would hate to do just have to restart this video over. Hang in there with me. Okay, so this this uh, tote is really slouchy. It doesn't, the, it holds its form pretty good as long as you don't have anything hanging on it. So if you guys want the link to this tote, let me know and I'll give it to you guys. But anyway, going back into the purse. I got a lot going on. Here is my little bag that I keep in all my purses. This is my bathroom bag. It has soap in it. Um, black cherry uh, hand soap. I'll just go ahead and take everything out and sit it in the front. Um, some hand sanitizer by Touchland. Toilet seat covers, sanitary napkin. I have one of these no water needed um, disposable toothbrush brushes. Um, I have some placards in here. Some black cherry hand lotion, hand cream. Some black cherry room spray. This stuff smells amazing. But they they discontinued their black cherry, so um, I have to order it offline. I have some um, little baggies that I use for um, disposing, like sanitary napkins and tampons and things like that, or anything that you, you know, want to dispose of. Um, and I, again, here's my paper soap. And these are pretty cool, although I don't use them like that. Um, I actually had a few few packets of these, a few little containers, and I took and combined a bunch of them, so that's why they always look like they're full, because I just, I keep this full just in case. These are more so for everybody else around me, 
And the hand soap is more for me. Because I love the black cherry scent of the hand uh, soap. And so that's it for this bag. I'm just going to move it over. Actually, let me go ahead and uh, throw everything back in here. I'm just going to toss it in there. For now, I'll straighten it out later. And both soaps. All right. Moving on, this will probably be a long video, but it won't be as long as it has been. Bella, no. It's my cat trying to get in. Um, this is the bag I keep my um, extra pair of underwear and extra socks in. So, there's no sense of me actually taking this out, but I will try to open it so you guys can kind of look see it's just merge emergency underwear and socks guys and this goes to all my bags i haven't had to use anything thank god so that's always a plus <laughs> but you never know so it's best to keep that packed um this bag right here is kind of my little cosmetic brushing up items in here um So in here, I have a Champagne Toast um, Body Mist. I have a, and by the way, um, this denim um, cosmetic pouch came from Amazon as well, um, along with another one that I have inside the bag. Um, I seriously got a mess going on, it's too early. But this one came from Amazon. I thought it would match with the purse pretty well because I, it's hard to find denim items. So I went ahead and got this. Toulouse, stop. My cats are going bananas. I got this from Amazon with the purse. And it, this came in a three-piece set. So it had a really big one. This one and a one that's a little bit smaller or a little bit and a little bit taller. So in here... It's the Champagne Toast Body Mist from Bath & Body Works. Here is the Champagne Toast Body Cream. Um, some of my favorite items is the Laneige um, Pear Lip Balm. I have this Lano Lips Strawberry. Um, I have this, what is it? It's like a gloss, a lifter gloss by Maybelline. My favorite deodorant. Some bum bum cream. I use that as like a hand cream. I have a Brazilian kiss balm in here. And this little um, bath and body work um, pocket back holder. I keep Victoria's Secret. Uh, sample size perfumes in here so it's five in there all five of them are different uh, scent I also keep my clear um, great lash in here I have quite a few lippies in here guys um, this one's a vanilla bean um, gloss I have a cuticle cream in here my Burt's Bees, another um, Laneige lip balm, which to me those are more like glosses. I have my cuticle remover and cuticle um, oil in here by a Deborah Lipman, a brow, um, a brow pencil in black, another Lippy Winter Candy Apple. Bath and Body Works. Um, always got to keep a little bottle of rubbing alcohol in my bags. Always. And my ear cleaning tool. So, that's all that was in that bag. So, let me go ahead and go to my next bag. Which is like um, electronics slash like medications and stuff like that. Over the counter meds and 
things like that. So let me go ahead and get this stuff put into this bag. I'm going to have fun straightening all this stuff out later. But I did it for you guys, so it's all that matters. <laughs> so I'm going to sit this to the side. I'm going to go ahead and for my last... Um, my last pouch inside this bag because I don't have anything else in it. This video might just be a little bit shorter than my others, guys. So, I'm sorry about that. But I do love this tote. It's just that it's... I'm not used to a tote that's not structured. So, it's going to take me a, a little bit to get used to. Anyway, this is my last... Um, bag and like I said this one has like medications in it and electronic stuff so I'm going to go ahead and empty this one out for you guys show you guys what's in it I love these denim um, cosmetic bags so what's in this one is my got a call trying to come through um, my Lily on Stitch AirPods case with my AirPods Generation 2 in here. My AirPods Pros because I I have to have both of them, guys. I'm sorry. Um, I have to have music when I go somewhere or when I just want to kind of tune the world out for a minute. Um, here is my back scratcher. I have my forehead forehead headache um, relief, my clear breast um, mints, my mentos. I have some little wooden cuticle sticks, and these I actually use to clean my AirPods out, like so they don't get nasty and dirty. I cannot stand to see people with AirPods and they are filthy. I think that's just. Oh my gosh, this is disgusting. I mean, we all have wax in our ears, but damn. You know, too much is too much. So, I have these Altoids um, Arctic Strawberry. Um, they're like a... I don't know. They're like candies to me. Like, But they do have a, like a cool sensation when, you, when you're eating them. They're good. They're not like mints to me. Um, I have my 4-in-1 Stanley Tool in here. Every girl should have one. I have my little Dollar Tree flashlight in here. That is probably going to go dead. So I probably need to pick up another one. Um, I have my charger brick in here. Uh, I don't have my watch on, guys. It's dead. This is a tool I also have for cleaning my AirPods and electronics. Um... I don't know if I'm going to be able to open it right now. Probably not. But it just has like a little um, pick side to it. And it has like a little fuzzy side. And you just get it down in there and keep your AirPods and electronics, phones or whatever. Speakers clean. Um, in here, I have my B12 and my vitamin C uh, in here. Excuse all the nail polish under my nails. I was having a uh, nail crisis yesterday. And I still am. Here is my lens cleaner for my eyeglasses and also my electronics. It's just in this cute little uh, clear pouch. That's how they come. I keep a backup watch band um, in my bag because I don't buy the authentic Apple watch band. So I'm scared one of them might break. This is the one I have on now that I got from AliExpress. So also the... Um, the case cover for the face it came from amazon if you guys want any of this stuff um let me know and i will list and link what i can here's some extra ear tips for my airpods always keep a source of light uh fire on you so i have a lighter i have this little doohickey for my cell phone um i have this cord a fast cord it's a rapid or i forget what they call them fast charger and of course some um tweezers in here every girl needs those too i have some tums in here i got the little daily life sticker because it's something i almost have to use 
every day or every other day now. The older I get, the more Pepto-Bismol and Tums I have to have. So this is Pepto-Bismol. I think I called them Tums. Pepto-Bismol, Tums, almost the same thing. Um, here is my um, travel pill case. And this is what's in it. I have a Leave Exeteran, um, Pamperin, Bear Chewable, and Cherry. Um, I have some Ibuprofen, some Midol, and some Benadryl in here. So, that's my little travel container for my over-the-counter pills. I also have in here, video is almost ending, guys. It's almost shorter than my other ones. I have some day quill and night quill tablets in here because the weather is going absolutely bananas here in Colorado. Like one day it's snowing, the next day it's 70 degrees. It's crazy. And here is my little ouch pouch, my boo boo box. And in here, I just have a few things like some um, liquid skin, some Zycam. Um, some triple antibiotic ointment. Um, I have a bunch of band-aids in here. So, so yeah, guys, I'm glad I could share this video with you guys today. Lord knows it took me long enough to do it. So, anyway, guys, that's what's in my bag. And that's the bag I am carrying uh, this month. Again, this bag is from Amazon. And this bag was only $27. Can you believe that? It's, it's a very nice sturdy bag, actually. But it doesn't sit up on its own. Like, it just doesn't. So, yeah. But I like it a lot. Um, I was trying to figure out if I wanted to actually use an organizer in it. But I think that an organizer in this bag would make it like 10 times heavier. Like, not 10 times, but you know twice as heavy so you guys i appreciate you guys being so patient and waiting for all my what's in my bag videos um i just bought another tote and i will have another video coming up in a few weeks i don't know exactly when because i don't change my bag so often guys but i am very thankful to my loyal subscribers Thank you so much, and I'm so happy to share this video with you guys today. You guys, rate, comment, subscribe, and have a blessed day.